oh, sorry, you were there. Uh, I was just having a chat with Josie, my new plant friend. I've noticed that in this room, the only other alive being is actually a plant. So I gave her a name. Some friends asked me what she was called. And since my sourdough also has a name, Johnny, I thought Josie was quite nice. So welcome to day five of Quarantine Files. Today, again, like yesterday, there was lots of work meetings. So not so much interesting actually happened other than, than lots of work. But I managed to run 8K this morning, which you will see right now. So that's the 8K done and dusted, so to say. It's been quite difficult just to concentrate on getting it done. I think it, it's not so much physically, but it's about sticking at it and, and not stopping. But I found yesterday when I was listening to the happiness podcast that little rewards or little goals can really help. So what I did before I started, I ordered myself a copy uh, Tiam and a kaya toast so with a soft boiled egg. And this is just on its way to me, so I'm really looking forward to that. And I'll, I'll uh, post a picture afterwards uh, of what it looks like when it gets here. Uh, but this little thing kept me going, I think, uh, quite well, rather than my uh, tired and foggy brain this morning. So I look forward to that and the rest of the day, and uh, we'll see what happens next. And um, then it was off to some meetings. I'm not going to post a match about this because it looks exactly the same as yesterday. Uh, me sitting in front of the computer for the whole day. Um, and I, I want to thank everybody who watches these movies. It's not self-explanatory that they provide <laughs> any entertainment at all. Um, but I really like that uh, I managed to get 50 about 50 subscribers by now. And it's thanks to lots of hard work uh, of everyone. So thank you very much to, for this. And please carry on. I'm gonna try it again. It's either here or here subscribing and liking. This is very useful. As I've told you yesterday, I want to be able to give a thousand Singapore dollars to a charity by the end of um, the, my stay here. And for this, I, I think it's important that we get to a thousand subscribers. So the more people subscribe, the more I'm able to give to a charity. And I'm, I'm in the process of checking which one would be good. And I think it should be something that has to do with people living in difficult conditions, in confined spaces, because that's what I'm you know, grateful to be able to experience at the moment. And even though this is quite a luxurious hotel room, the psychology, the psychological effect of being confined still plays a role. Um, and yes, it's much better because I know that I can count the number of days when I'm going to be able to uh, exit through the door at the end of the hallway over there. Um, I have been thinking of whether it's an idea or not to open it, um, but I think it's a bad idea. I won't do that. And I also wanted to thank all my friends and colleagues from around the world who are sending me little gifts. So I've, I've received today two breakfasts, which was very nice. And then I got some chocolates from Janice Wong, who I really like. Um, and then the, the other, uh, and some wine as well. And then the other funny thing that happened is as I was watching TV uh, over my lunch break, I found out that, that um, 
Dylan, the chef from a restaurant in Singapore, the Masses, was on TV about his uh, roasted pork belly. So I will put this in the video as well right now. And that's it. So it looks delicious and uh, I'm dying to try it out. And especially now that I know that he's actually sold 10,000 pieces and he only started this business in lockdown in Singapore. And this is another thing that, that Dylan does so well is this idea of being confronted with adversity, which he was when lockdown happened, basically the restaurants had to shut down. And what Dylan did so well is instead of giving up, giving up he actually retained his whole team and doubled down and went completely online. And I'm sure that he did a great business because everything he produced was of such high quality. And I certainly enjoyed the APAM uh, branches that he did on Saturdays and Sunday together with um, another colleague of him, a hawker stall owner. And I think it, it show much, so much displays what you can do if you actually say, OK, that's the situation I'm in. And I want to make something out of it. And hopefully this is also what I'm able to do, learn something for myself and learn something that can be applied outside of this hotel room and something that, that's beneficial for other people. And hopefully in the process, uh, some good will come out of, you know, MOM asking me to, to stay here uh, for a while. Um, and yes, I'm going to carry on running as long as my knees don't give way. So we'll see how much I can do tomorrow, but I'm aiming for 9k tomorrow morning. So you'll be able to see tomorrow night whether I manage this. So keep tuned in and uh, subscribe because that's going to be the best way to find out. And I think with this, um, I will close the day for today. So day five in quarantine. Oh, yes. And one more thing I wanted to do is uh, I think it's it's really great how the JW Myatt is is trying its best effort and quite succe successfully at making this feel like a stay in their hotel, not a stay in quarantine. And by this, I mean, they call up and they ask whether we need anything. What could they bring? They have this program where you can scan, as I showed you, a QR code. Uh, regularly and then you can go and uh, attend some events that they're organizing so I think this is very highly appreciated that they make this effort of uh, they are running a hotel and we are guests in I'm their hotel sure uh, obviously my watch is not really happy with what I'm saying um, sorry about this so this has been great and uh, thank you everyone for watching thank you for following thank you for all your support uh, this is really what helps me to get through this. I think like everybody else, there's ups and downs. But to know that some of you are watching and are enjoying this uh, has been tremendously helpful. So thank you, everyone.